been really happy with the women this indoor season. They, um, from the very beginning, even in the fall, they just had a terrific mindset. They made up their mind they want to be good, and, and they, they become a very close team, very supportive of each other, um, and the results were obvious right away. As soon as we started the indoor season, they started breaking records. Every kid is hitting big, big PRs, and you could just see, okay, this is a special group. Uh, and uh, they just started feeding off each other's positive energy and the momentum just kept building and, and, and now shoot, they broke a bunch of records um, and I think they're poised to have a really, really good meet this weekend. Um, I think heading into the outdoor season, typically if you're good indoors, you can be good outdoors. And then uh, we have some uh, javelin throwers that don't get to compete indoors, they'll get to compete outdoors and they're very talented and hungry. So I think this is, is really gonna be a terrific indoor and outdoor season and we're going to look back on 2015 as, as really one of the best uh, seasons the women have had in a very long time. This is a special group of kids. So this year I just uh, brought some experience to the team. I tried to be a resource for my teammates. Um, just being out, it helped me uh, not only get a perspective on everything but also just to kind of be there for everyone and help coach a little bit here and there since I have a lot of experience. So that's kind of what I brought being injured this year. Chaley Rath has, has really stepped up her game this year. She's a sophomore and um, she's having a great meet so far, has a couple PRs on the day, um, and she'll be, she's the favorite now in the high jump, which will be tomorrow. Uh, Rachel Pate, she's also doing great, um, and our freshman, uh, Lauren Frederick, she's on PR pace. So, um, so far, so good. Everybody looks like they, they've got their minds right, and, um, and I'm excited, I, I'm gonna enjoy watching them.